First of all, welcome to Jam Masters. This product will be this is the product I will be presenting to Alon Productions. With Jam Masters, we aim to create a high quality guitar magazine which targets a wide range of demographics and attempts to become significantly more mainstream than other magazines of the same genre. We attempt to capture the attention of readers, not becoming a barrier to their musical understanding. Above, I have included a number of magazines that will rival mine. Total Guitar, I Guitar and Acoustic Guitar. Admittedly, these are great magazines. However, most of these magazines fail to reach a widespread audience due to being too masculine. Therefore, I will broaden my demographics so that my magazine will also be aimed at women and ethnic minorities, as well as coming up with a suitable price that is affordable for pe all people interested in guitar. Not only will we go through this, but I will include celebrity musicians with a wide range of ethnic backgrounds and musical understanding. Preferably, my target audience will be aimed at men between the ages of 30 to 60, yet Jam Masters will work differently to previous magazines. Our product will include content that will appeal towards beginners as well as experienced players, an aspect that other magazines of this genre fail to deal with. However, we will also ensure to include tutorials and tabs that will be easier for beginners to follow as well as endless details about guitar from all over the world, an aspect that we are sure will appeal to our more experienced players. Christopher is an unmarried 31-year-old year old art teacher from London. His love for rock and roll music and both acoustic and electric guitar is sensational. This means that he spends most of his disposable income on his passion. Chris has signed up to multiple social media accounts such as Facebook and Instagram. Chris is often searching up these accounts that show updates on his favourite bands. In Chris's spare time, he enjoys playing in his band with his friends, covering songs by Nirvana and the Foo Fighters. Chris's favourite YouTuber is Marty Schwartz, who frequently does tutorials on guitar, and he is also a fan of Justin Sandico and more. Our magazine offers a wide range of ways to purchase, on the App Store, on the Play Store, for Samsungs, etc. We believe that increasing av availability of our product will be boost our profit dramatically. This is because less money will be spent on printing equipment and material that make up the magazine. In order for our customers to comply with our idea, we supply some special subscription offers. Down below are some other ideas we came up with. Two sheets of glossy guitar stickers come with six month subscription to the website. With a yearly subscription to Jam Masters, you will receive a free Jam Masters t-shirt and a subscription to the website will include 10% discount off, off, off on the closed door. This will increase our profits dramatically. This is because less money will be spent on printing equipment and material to make up the magazine. We are aware that at the beginning of Jam Masters magazine, we will struggle to make profit or break even. However, I can assure you this. However, I can assure you this will be short-lived. We have conducted research upon magazines in the same genre as ours. This year, Q, Q had a readership number of 118,000. During the end of 2021, we hope that our product will attain a readership of roughly 40,500 a figure that will be groundbreaking for a niche magazine of this sort. On the other hand, we expect that our total circulation will greatly exceed this with 95,000 individuals reading our magazine on print and digital platforms which are, which are offer the public to register on the website. I believe this will be effective because I have my customers details on record so I can send them direct prospers via email and text messages. In order for our magazine to stay consistent, we will ensure to offer synergy with companies such as Usician to offer deals with my customers. However, more importantly, I aim, to assure, I aim to ensure to produce new and improved content with every issue, as I will spend roughly 75000 on efficient, keen journalists and 45000 on editors and graphic designers, where I will ensure to supply them with the best materials and printing, which I plan to spend at least £15,000 on, on my budget towards in the first years a number that will increase once my magazine has reached a point of continuous stability. All in all, this funding will ensure I am able to assemble a team who think creatively and, and adapt their content to the reader and their necessities. Jam Masters 
will, will only be published digitally for the first year on a monthly basis as we aim to produce a pagination of 50 pages which we believe is the most effective as rushing into things quickly could increase the risk of the business landing on difficulties. I'm also aware that distribution may cost my magazine so I expect I will be paying a sum of money of around £10,000 for my magazine to be spent on to, to be sent to stores. Each magazine sold at a price of £5.50, around £497,750. In this second year, we expect to make extra on the incentives and advertisement sales. Under the production of my magazine, I will ensure my team are educated on legalities and ethics. First of all, we need to ensure the safety of our magazine. A group of well-trained lawyers will make sure that the breaching rights to our magazine will be illegal and offenders will be prosecuted for copyright. Trade marketing, our brand, will ensure no one can make money off our effort and ideas. Thank you for taking the time to listen to our pitch. We appreciate your support greatly. We can assure it is in our best interest to work with Alon Productions with efficiency. So again, thank you for your time. We hope that you believe in our product as much as we do. Is there any further questions? Thank you very much, Harry. It was a great pitch. Uh, I really like the idea of a, like, a niche guitar magazine. Um, clearly, you've done your research on rivals, etc. Um, there was just one tiny little contradiction that I just want to cover. If you just go back to budget, you mentioned in your pitch that it was going to be um, digital for the first year, yeah. okay? But then also you've got a costing in there for distribution. So mm. I'm not. I'm, I'm just trying to be clear as obviously as a client. Well, that that, that distribution will be for the second year. That's ah, for the, for the second, second year. year. I see. Okay, that's great. So it will be digital only for the first. Digital for the first. And your idea for increasing circulation was to do with uh, the clothes store. So you got ten percent off. Yes. And do you feel that that's a market that people that play guitar, you know, that they're interested in that sort of thing, like clothing? How how would that work? We, we plan to make this more than just a magazine, we want to make it a community. People who enjoy this, you know, and they're, they're, to be able to express themselves with the clothing that we offer. Okay, that's great. Um, and also, can you just talk a little bit about the website? Like, how, how would you envisage this working on a, on a website? For example, I guess things like um, guitar magazines will have a lot of like tutorials and whatnot. So, Possibly on the website or in the digital version, do you think you could incorporate videos? How would, how would that work? Well, absolutely. Though. You know, we, we can offer CDs, videos, we will be, you know, we'll have trained guitarists that will be doing tutorials for beginners and experience. Something that I don't think other guitars have, you know, they've had issues with. Okay, and final question. You mentioned um, that you wanted to target uh, women and uh, other um, ethnic groups. And you've mentioned obviously uh, legal and ethical issues at the end. Um, so are you aware of any kind of female musicians? How would you pull the female readership in? Okay, you've mentioned that in the target audience at the beginning. So how how do you feel that you target? Well, you know, if if you um, play it, female rock icons like Avril Lavigne, we'll get in touch okay. with people like that. So you yep. know, it shows that it's more you know it's okay for women to you know be involved in this kind of thing. We, we offer it. We, our doors are wide open to people like that. We'll have a People that, such as B King, a great jazz musician, you know, people like him, so ethnic minorities can So it won't just be rock, there'll be a variety of genres in there as well. I guess Jam Masters it's is about enjoying music. It's about enjoying video. music and then expressing the guitar and showing, showing people what we're about. Brilliant. Thank you very much.